Good evening. I'm Mai Rodriguez. Thanks for joining us. After spending three years in detention, former Senator Jingoy Estrada is a free man for now. That's after the Sandigan Bayan granted his motion to post bail in connection with his plunder and graft cases. He celebrates his first day of freedom through a Thanksgiving Mass with relatives, friends and supporters. Our Rex Remitio is at the St. John the Baptist Church in San Juan to tell us more. Rex, how's the former senator now? It was a bittersweet day for former Senator Jingoy Estrada. He says he's happy that he's now free, at least for a while, but he's also sad that his uh, compare, ex-Senator Bong Revilla, is still in detention. Both of them were jailed in 2014 for um, their alleged involvement in a multi-billion peso scam. Uh, they were alleged of uh, receiving kickbacks from uh, pork barrel funds supposedly via bogus non-government organizations. But he believes that uh, they were just victims of uh, what he calls selective justice during the administration of former President Noynoy Aquino. Mabalik ang korobar, ang mga tao na gunaan ng aking kalayaan. Ipatitikim ko rin to ba sa kanila ang matanding senaryo pinatikim nila sa akin. Magpakulit-kulit man ang mga ganung-tanong ay isa lang ang aking sasabihin. Mahala na po ang Diyos sa kanila. He also says he has forgiven former Justice Secretary Laila Dilima, who put him behind bars, but he's also quick to say he will never forget what she did to him. He believes Revilla will have his own taste of freedom in the coming days, but when it comes to pork scam queen Janet Napoles, if she should be freed as well, Estrada only says no comment. In his message, he also thanked his family for being his rock throughout the, year, uh, the three years of what he calls a nightmare. Siyempre, masayang masaya lahat kami. At last, uh, mahilip na almost three years yata si Jingo. At na, we really miss him a lot. Siyempre. He says that uh, he's now um, unemployed. Since he's now unemployed, he can take care uh, of his uh, mother, former Senator Eloy Estrada. He also hints, insists he's not guilty of any graft or corruption. May. Rex, what are his plans in the coming weeks or months? Well, he says he's going on a vacation with his uh, family around the country, but he's also willing to help the Duterte administration uh, in its policies and programs. He says his support uh, to the president's war on drugs is 101%. And uh, if he's willing, uh, if he's uh, given a cabinet position, he says he, uh, he, he's willing to accept it. And uh, he also says that um, if uh, he has any plans to return to politics, he says he will think about it. Mine. Rex Remitio reporting live from San Juan.